Hey guys, today I'm going to show you the manual way of configuring the Apache web server to publish your web pages such as PHP, HTML, or in your internet, that is in your local network. In the previous tutorial, I have shown you the automatic way by using AZPHP software that is our web server now we are going to use apache web server and php so first download php and apache server setup i have provided into the description the two links just download them so you will have these two files okay after downloading the php in the, it is a zip file just like click right click over there click extract so you can extract it anywhere but i'm preferring that you should extract it over your c drive okay extract here we will need this php to configure it with the apache server okay now launch the setup file of apache web server just double click it and follow my instructions to install the apache web server okay just follow this wizard in the network domain type local host you can type here your ip address as well but we are going to choose it as localhost in the server name localhost also and you can put your email id here okay so we have two options for all users on port 80 if you are using IIS or any other server then the conflict may be there so check, check this for all users on port 80 as a service okay hit next then typical installation next then this is the apache directory where your apache server will be installed just click next and install it now it will install apache server so now we will try to create a sample script okay This is the PHP block in which you write your PHP scripts. Okay, so when the Apache server will interpret your file, it will recognize that code written in this block is PHP script. So it will use PHP interpreter to interpret your code. Okay. Then we'll try to take simple example. We call hello world. This is simply for printing the what it is installing right now. It is simply for printing text on your normal browser. Okay. Let's check the status. Okay. Now it is installed will come on this script letter so now you have installed your apache server okay and you are having php on your c drive in php folder okay so you can see there apache http server 2.2 okay now these are sources where you can restart your apache server then start it and stop it okay and this is the apache monitor as you can see the icon apache 2.2 okay now let's check our server just type in the server local host and hit enter and i think we are having our previous index file into that folder that's why it is showing hello for php is here 
otherwise it shows it works okay so no matter let's go to the root directory root directory means where so we will look for the files okay apache apache software foundation then apache 2.2 this is the path of our apache server you can see here okay so htdocs this is the root directory you can see this is the index page which is shown after the successful work okay close it now how to configure apache server with php so go to all programs apache http server 2.2 then configure apache server edit the apache httpd.com configuration files it is a configuration file for apache server this is nothing but the simple commands file so text file which describes the working for the apache web server okay now we have to add three commands over here first is search for load module you can see various modules are available here so you have to write one command load module php file underscore module then path of your php folder that is c colon slash php slash php file apache 2 underscore 2 dot dla you have to write this manually over here after that you have to add add type look just like there already done it look you have to manually add this one also add type application slash x dash httpd dash php space dot php so it will recognize the php pages okay now the last one we have to enter it into the last line of this file that is php ini directory so our directory is c column slash php okay just save this file and restart your apache server okay if everything goes fine no error will be there otherwise it will show an error now we'll try to create one php script over here okay Is the basic php block you can see echo manual configuration is done and save it with index dot php or any your name such as sample dot php you can use any editor and using notepad now put the address localhost slash sample dot php oops made a bargain as i'm also installing zphp that's why it is getting confused so we are going to use port number 80 over here no. Some error must be there. I'm gonna stop this. Okay, so easy PHP stop. Look, localhost slash sample.php manual configuration is done. So the output is but you will not get the, that error that object not found if you are not having another server and having two servers is the PHP as well that's why the server got conflict between those two ports okay. so in this way you can do manual configuration
Thank you. Like one, please.